New details about an apparent racist encounter in a Wendy's drive through A man pointing a gun and yelling racial slurs at a black couple while they were waiting for their food. News 4's Natalie Clydesdale first told you about this story earlier this week. She joins us in studio with an update. Natalie. Well, Bren, the victims want to stay anonymous, but they say they're relieved now that the man who threatened to kill them is in jail. Honking their horn, yelling at them, even yelled some racial slurs toward them. 57-year-old Michael Sutherland is now behind bars after a disturbing encounter, apparently fueled by hate, in a Wendy's drive through You may remember, earlier this week, we told you about a black couple waiting for their food at the Wendy's on North Rockwell Avenue when Sutherland pulled up behind them in his pickup truck. And the person behind them began getting upset. Court documents say Sutherland was, quote, holding a black pistol on the dash pointed in their direction and can be seen on security cameras, quote, pulling the slide back as if he is chamber loading the firearm. Sutherland then allegedly yelling, quote, I'll shoot you, you expletive racial slur, and quote, that's what is wrong with the United States. Go back to Africa, according to court records. As they pulled out, the victim actually followed the suspect to a uh, local hospital where the guy pulled in the parking lot. Some words were exchanged. The victim left. He met with officers, made a police report. Sutherland is now booked in the Oklahoma County Detention Center on a felony complaint for pointing a firearm and malicious harassment based on race. In response to the news, the victim's telling News 4, quote, we are definitely relieved that Michael is in jail where he needs to be and off the streets. The world is much safer with him behind bars. Sutherland's bond is set at $100,000.